Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome back to another lock of Zipper Heads Pass Along Box. This is um, an American lock, three digit uh, combination lock. It has this, this spinning dial here and yeah, 40 numbers and three combination, uh, three ditches as I mentioned. So there inside here are two wheels and then the, the third wheel is actually connected directly to the dial and if you know the combination you can enter it and open the lock um, but it also has another weak point um, this is here this wafer lock on the back i think this is created for yeah uh, if it's put on on school lockers or so that one person with the right key can open all locks or so. Um, and when I when I got this, when I opened the box and I saw this lock, I was super happy because I really wanted to try to decode this. But I couldn't find a way yet to decode this. So for now I will stick to the, the back and show you how to pick it. So Let's put it in a vise. Still locked. Maybe like this. I'm using this tensioner from Multipick. Oh, I have to put it a bit more in the front, otherwise the tensioner will get stuck. So like this, just tension it from here and then this thick pick from multi pick with the gem like profile and just brushing over the wafers. It already clicks a bit and the core moves a bit. Yeah, you can't see anything. So I'm not so used to picking wafer locks, but in general it's it's almost the same as pin tumblers, tumblers, right? You find the one that is stuck and you, you push it. Even set wafers feel like they're you can you can jiggle on them. Like the jiggle test. Now I'm struggling a bit, so this is a two-sided wafer lock, so you really have to pick both sides. Okay, there we go. Now it's open and you can open the shackle. Yep. Inside here you see do we have light in there? You can see the wafers. And also you can see the wheels a bit, but it will be un impossible to show this on, on camera. But yeah, maybe I will still find a way to decode it. I hope so, but I can't guarantee and I don't want to hold the package with me just to figure out how to decode it. So I'll play around a bit with it more but we'll see if I find a way. Anyhow, um, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. And yeah, see you in the next video. Bye.